Happy Monday. Today is April 30th, 2012. My name is Phil Osophical and I am super excited today because these are three three new reasons to be optimistic that I haven't really made any videos about before. So the three reasons, the first reason is because we can reallocate resources. The concept of reallocation of just using something we already have and putting it to a new use is reason number one to be optimistic about the future. Second reason is because we can do both and solutions. So instead of looking at our issues and trying to say either or, we can do both and. So that's number two. And number three is simply because of the internet which I have talked about before, but I'm ex super excited to see it, the internet as, as a global brain, uh, a nervous system uh, communications network. So these are the three reasons. Um, the first one, and all, all these three reasons are embodied in this video that I'm gonna post. So the video is of a group in what I call Peaceburg, also known as Pittsburgh, it's called GTEC. And what they do is incredible garden projects around the city. And um, one of the things they're doing embodies all three of these reasons to be optimistic. So what they're doing is they're planting, this, this is not where they're doing it, but they're planting, imagine this used to be a toxic uh, lot where a house got taken down and they'll, they'll plant sunflowers here a whole bed of sunflowers and so there's three main three main benefits of planting sunflowers one is that it cleans up toxic soil two is that it beautifies the neighborhood it turns a vacant lot into a blossoming yellow forest of beauty and three they then harvest the the sunflowers for biofuels so it's this three-pronged solution. So instead of, so that embodies the first reason to be optimistic because we're reallocating this vacant lot that wasn't used for anything. We're putting it to a whole new purpose. And, and then it also is using a both and solution. It's really a, a troth and, I guess you could say, whatever the word would be for that. It's three things instead of choosing one because um, I feel like we often get trapped in, in an either-or conundrum where we're trying to choose between two options. But with this, they're having a both-and solution by planting sunflowers. They're cleaning up the soil, they're beautifying the neighborhood, and they're, um, and they're harvesting biofuels. So they're not saying, oh, we could just plant flowers, regular flowers, that wouldn't clean up the soil. Or they're not saying we could um, we could just harvest biofuels by planting corn they're doing all three and there's millions of other examples of this so it's an amazing reason to be optimistic because if you just switch your mindset to always looking for both and solutions then you can find so much more and um, and then the third reason talking about the global brain um, I made this video simply by going there with a camera for two minutes and filming them and then I could put it on the internet and using the global brain this giant network imagine it stretched all over the globe this tiny little two minute video can go to any single corner that has access to the internet and that's just incredible that that was not even fathomable 20 years ago so we can just broadcast these solutions and never before in the history of the entire planet has has these solutions been able to share and cross-reference and just collaborate throughout history but now we can do it using the internet the global brain so those are the three easy reasons to be optimistic there's so many more out there on this YouTube channel on other YouTube channels so please check out the GTEC video about the sunflowers. It's just a metaphor that we can apply in many other ways. And I would really love to hear any both and solutions that you have. Um, please share a comment here on Facebook or um, on YouTube. 
If you want to check out my website, phil-osophical.com, I'm going to be adding a blog today. Um, there's just so many reasons to be optimistic. These are just three. So thank you for watching. Have a happy Monday. Scoobly-doo-ba-doo. Peace.